it's bingo up here valley we're getting to go riding again today for project ride more we're going to the big musky bucket and then we're gonna go to a place called boondocks the boondock bar and grill so it says i should get to my first destination by one o'clock and it's not much further to the next location so we'll be back hey this is just starting out i'll get some good video for you today and uh a great place to go for Project Ride More. Alrighty, we're out. Alrighty. Well, to save some time, we jumped on the highway, knocked out about 60 miles, got off on uh, at Cambridge on the 209, come down and made a right on the 660 heading west. Check out the airplane. Cool beans. Well, that's the nice thing about riding. See them sights. There's this whole area around here, kind of like through uh, Salt Fork Lake area, down there, lots of things to see. Nice smooth roads though, pretty cleaned off. Don't have to worry about gravel on the side, so forth. Nice scenery. We're going into Clark's, uh oh, Claysville. Yeah, I've been here before. Heard this way to Hocking Hills there a couple of years ago come down this road. Uh, let's see, I'm on um, Route 83. What a beautiful little road. It's a little rugged, but it's nice, nice, nice road to go down. Heading on to the boondock here. Heading down through Wayne National Forest, I do believe. This all goes towards Hawking Hills area now. This is probably part of the Windy Nine also. Um, there's a series of nine different routes out from Hawking Hills. It's called the Windy Nine. Okay, check it out online. left the buck uh, the well, boondock the boondock bar and grill that's a nice old place so we're gonna head up to the uh, big musky bucket it's only 14 minutes away 10 miles i guess this is a muskegon river it's a nice little river it's not a little river it's it's a good sized little river <laughs> it's not just a little creek i give it that we're going right into the town where the corporate lives in McConnell Bill. Right near State Park too. That'd probably be a nice place to go. Do a nice little rider. In 800 feet, turn left on the West Jefferson Avenue. Alrighty. Oh, like a half a mile from the big musky bucket. Have you ever seen this? You can look it up online. It's real easy to get to. It's a great ride getting here. And it's not that far from the Boondock uh, Bar and Grill, which has really great food. And it, it's a nice place. And if you if you want to take a, a bag lunch, they do have picnic tables and stuff there. And it's a pretty neat place to go see. Uh, years ago, if you look at the history of it, it was used to strip mine. It's now the Miners are Memorial, which is pretty cool. It's a really neat place. They do have bathroom the facilities. The new destination will be on the left. Do have bathroom facilities and stuff here, uh, picnic tables, so forth. I uh, could have went up in there, but I tend to turn up here. Take the next left. Then your destination will be on the right. I'd like to see what's coming on. I hate, don't like doing blind curves. Yep. It's nice and paved, easy to get in. 
And you see, it's a huge, huge, huge bucket. I believe how much gravel and dirt would fit in that. They have a nice little bathroom there. They have a little area. The and they have picnic tables the right. throughout the grass. So definitely a neat place to come see. All right, we're going to go off and explore a little bit, take some more photos, and that's what them people are doing. See, the lady brought her lunch. Awesome. Alrighty, there's the bucket. It is a big bucket, a very big bucket. With lots of chains, lots of rocks. Just to give you an idea how big it is. We'll go around the inside here. They got the history and everything there. Nice park. You, you, you can't smell the smells of the flowers that are right over there and stuff. It smells so good here right now. And everything's so green. But yeah, there you go. That's a big bucket. You could put a couple pickups in there. I know we could put about 20 motorcycles in there. But hey, nice park. They said you got camping, or not camping, but a picnic areas in the shade stuff. Beautiful place. Bathrooms here. Nice concrete parking for motorcycles so you can park it in the asphalt. Here's a customer of Valley, Josh. He brought his Pan American out for a ride today. <laughs> he met me down here to have lunch with me and go ride back with me. So, all right, we're going to get on the road and head back. So yeah, that's a big musky. If you're looking for some more ride, we're Project Ride More. Stop by the shop and sign up. Come down and see it. Have a good one.